you can see the difference. This is like very dull and this is very, very smooth. So that's the difference. Hey guys, Michelle here. Welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to do another review of a hair straightening product. So without further ado, let's get started. So right over here, the product that I'm going to be reviewing for you today is the Daphne Hair Straightening Brush Product. Now the difference between the other brush product that I have reviewed is that this is actually cordless free. So you know what that means. That's a lot of convenience for a lot of people who wants to use their brush on the go. So aside from the brush, I also got their hair care product, which is their shine line. The reason being is because I do have a very frizzy and a little bit of unmanageable hair when it comes to the ends of my hair because of the split ends. So I decided to, hey, why not give this a go as well? So yeah, um, let's go ahead and let's get unboxing first before we get to the review. So with this product, I also got a mini Daphne magazine about this cordless brush, which is actually pretty cute. I went through them and it says so many information that you need to know with the brush. And I like how detailed, how, how informative they are with their magazines. I like that because I like to know what I'm using. So the next thing I have in this box is this very cute on-the-go pouch. It has their Daphne Allure and I like how sturdy and good quality it feels. Let me go ahead and put this aside. And the next thing I like about this product is that with their charging, okay? Because I know a lot of cordless stuff that when you charge it comes with its own like you know charging port the good thing about this one is you can charge it using the outlet or you can charge it using a usb type or if you want to charge it in your car works for you too so that's actually very good you can charge it at home you can charge it in the car or you can charge it on the plane so that's actually very good and very convenient for you to charge it so yeah and you don't have to purchase another usb you know for you to charge this one so that's very very good i love this one and the next thing of course the brush itself so this is what the brush looks like as you can see it is very very beautiful it's very tiny and it feels very smooth and on the brush it has a cover and as you can see it has that bristle and it's very good. It has the bristle to protect your hair and your scalp so that you wouldn't burn yourself. That's actually a plus side. So the charging time for this one is two hours if you want it to have it full charge. And it has four different stages. It has 25%, 50%, 75%, and 100%. So that's that. And over here you will have the light indicating if your hair or if your brush is ready to be used so if it's red it's not yet ready you have to wait until he it heats up and then when it's white and it makes the sound then it's ready to go right so this one also says here that for two hours is a full charge of a hundred percent and for that hundred percent you can use it for at least three heads on this one but for me based on my experience i used this one time and it took me less than five minutes and it says here the approximate time for the battery to last is 30 minutes. So if my hair takes less than 5 minutes, I can actually use this for more than 5 times, not 3 times. So now let me go ahead and show you guys how it fits perfectly inside of this cute little bag. Um, there you go. I'm going to put the brush inside. And in this side, you can see like there's a tiny pocket over here, which you can put your outlet charging thingy and your USB. I'm gonna put it put it that there and there you go I can bring it with me on the go it is very very cute like I said it's very compact you can use this literally everywhere everywhere you go right so now for the hair care product this one is their shine line so you can purchase this individually if you wish so but I got the set so this is a three-step hair care so the first one is 
their mousse. This is the hair straightening mousse. You use this after you shower and then you leave it on, on your hair for a couple of minutes and then you wash it off. Right, so that's step number one. And step number two is their, so that's not it, is their hair heat protective spray. And the step number three, which is N3, is Shine Hero Enriching Hair Serum. So this one is for after you have styled your hair. You can put this if you still have like that frizzy hair going on, the split end still showing, so you can actually use this one. All right, so now I'm going to show you guys a review as I use this product. Alright guys, so this is what my hair looks like without me styling it. So what you see on my other video with the perfect looking hair is, is not real. Because I have to style that. It takes a lot because as you can see like, that's my hair. It's, it's wavy. Alright, so N2, right over here it says this is a Guardian Angel Hair Heat Protective Spray. So it says on the bottle that to spray it on a damp hair. I do have a dry hair just because um, this is a one day old hair already. So I'm going to go ahead and spray it right here. So it says six inches apart. That actually smells very good. Like I like the smell. It doesn't like, it doesn't have that very strong chemi chemical smell, but it's actually pretty good. So it did say that it gives your hair that oil that it needs. All right, so now let's go on to the hairbrush itself. So this one is the brush, take out that, and I'm gonna go ahead and press the power button over here or switch the power button, and that's the sound that you're gonna hear. And I have to wait until this one turned green for me to actually start using it. It's, it's kind of like to remind me, hey, this is hot enough already, you know, you can use this. The thing about this one is I like that the black one, which is the plastic one, um, stands out more than the iron, which is like inside. So it kind of prevents you from like, um, what's the word? Hurting yourself because of the heat. So you know when you flat iron your hair, like you can accidentally touch the iron on its own and even when you use the curling iron that you can you have the potential to touch the iron and you're gonna get burnt but with this one like it's very nicey like it, I can feel that the iron is already hot but it prevents me from actually getting hurt even if I touch from here from here from here from here so it's actually protecting you from getting burnt all right so now that the color has turned white it means that it's already ready for you to use okay so let's go ahead and see what it looks like now so i'm gonna get a strand of hair so as you can see the hair is very frizzy and that's what that looks like so what i usually do is i go from up and i hold it like that And of course you do however you want to do, but this is how I like to do my hair, regardless what kind of material that I use. If I use flat iron or curling iron, I always do from the bottom because I do want to add volume to my hair. But now that is what that looks like. As you can see, there's a difference. Now it is very, very smooth. It doesn't look frizzy compared to before I actually brush it. So let's go ahead and do the other parts of the hair. Again. Do whatever works for you, your own technique, your own preference, go ahead and do that. You don't need to follow how I do my hair, but because this is what I'm very comfortable with when I do my hair. And it works for my hair when I do this. So that's good. So automatically, I can see the difference between my hair already. And it looks perfectly good and smooth and manageable. So already you can see how smooth the hair is and um, this spray literally helps add shine to your hair. Um, I kind of thought that maybe I should have not done that so that we can kind of see, see 
um, what it looks like without the products, but oh well, I already did it, so there's no turning back. is very, very long. I've been using a hair care routine lately that's making my hair grow like five times faster than it does. So like it's literally very long now. It's going to my hips already. So that's what that looks like. And it's not that hot. It's not going to burn your hair or your head as you go through it. But the thing I like about this brush, it's not even that heavy. At first I thought it was quite heavy, but when I tried carrying it and tried using it on my hair, it actually feels good. So that is what that looks like. As you can see, you can tell the difference between this hair. And it's very fast. It took me literally just less than three minutes to get my hair done. And this is what it looks like on the other side. So you can tell the difference and how smooth and shiny this one is. And there you go and you can actually add volume to this hair just like what i did so for this one as you can see it's still very dry this one is very shiny and it looks very smooth it doesn't even look that you flat ironed your hair it looks very natural it still has volume you know unlike um when you flat iron it it looks very flat and straight unless you like you do kind of like you know um technique you can see the difference this is like very dull and this is very, very smooth. So that's the difference. So when you see my hair looking all beautiful and, you know, <laughs> manageable, that's that's not a hairbrush look, okay? Let's be real. I, I cannot achieve that look without doing this. Because this hair has been treated, has been colored, it's, it's been... It's been tortured many times. So that is what that looks like as you can see. It's very smooth. I like it. And as for this one, it's just... <laughs> I'm going to go ahead and finish the other side of my hair. And I'm going to be right back. Alright guys, so now I'm back. I'm done with my hair. And it literally took me less than 5 minutes to get my hair done. And it's, it's good. All I can say, this is actually a very, very good product and it delivers what it promises and it gives that very shiny finished look i'm not sure it's because of the hairspray but i know some flat iron or sorry straightening brush leaves your hair very shiny even without the product but i think this one definitely helps just because when i sprayed it it already looks shiny and it gives that a little bit of oil on the hair um that's good in the beginning of the video I have like split ends everywhere and it was just frizzy all over so I was expecting it to be very dry and frizzy but this actually impressed me like it does like this is still very dry because this is just like very dead hair and I didn't put a lot of you know um work on the left side but this one like as you can see it looks very nice it doesn't even look like I have very very bad split ends it looks very very nice but let's go ahead and apply this one okay one two <laughs> i didn't want to put a lot all right it's it smells good all of the product smells actually really good so let me go ahead and put it <gasps> it's very shiny again i'm not really up for like the very very shiny kind of look but if you're if that's your vibe <sighs> this is for you so it actually improved from how it was in the beginning. All right, so now it's time for my overall review. All I can say is this product is very, very good. It does tend to heat a little bit, but not to a point that you're going to hurt yourself. It's not. It just heats up a little bit and it's fine. Right? And the second part that I like about this brush is that you can cover it. You can protect it just like that. There you go. And automatically you can protect your brush. So, and it's here. So there's no accident of you of pressing the buttons while it's in your bag. Because just like me, I would always keep this on the go with me whenever I go out. Just to touch up a little bit of my hair. 
um, or if I want to go somewhere, if we're gonna, if if me and my husband are gonna go for a long trip, this would come very, very handy, you guys. This is something like I can just go pack my bags, put my hair in a bun, and I'm gonna say, you know what? I'm just gonna do my hair and makeup on the plane. So usually I just do my makeup on the plane or in the car, you know, for a long drive. But for this one, I can do it while I'm in the car. Because I always do that. I'm the kind of person that always likes to do their makeup and always likes to do their hair on the go. So I would, uh, it would definitely help. So the thing with me is that whenever we go on a long trip or on a long drive, right, to somewhere for a quick holiday or vacation, what I would usually do is I would do my hair the night before or that morning and then do my makeup while in the car or while on the plane. But now I can actually just put my hair in a bun, no wake up, go to the car or go to the plane and just do everything right then and there so that I don't have to waste time doing it at home. So this is actually good. This is very, very handy. It's not that heavy. It's very light. I like it. At first, I actually thought that this is a bit heavy for me. When I unboxed it, I was like, this is kind of heavy. But now that I'm actually using it, to be honest with you, the one with the wire is actually making my arm hurt even more. I think it's because I spend time avoiding the wire or making it not be tangled. But with this one, I can literally move it like that, move it like that, move it like that. Like I can, I can go wherever direction that I want and it doesn't have to sprain my, my wrist from trying to avoid the wire, you know? So this is very good. Let's move on to the hair care product. So for the hair care product, this is a three-step hair care product. And I know that on their website, you can choose one individually and you can use, you can buy a set, right? So for this one, this is good for you if you're, if you're having a problem with a very frizzy, dry hair this would help a lot. So just like for me, I have a lot of frizz on the top of my head. Like, I don't know if you can see that still, but because I've already put a serum, so it's not that visible. But without it, I swear to you, I would get a lot of frizz on my hair and the split ends would show. But with this one, like I said, this one alone doesn't even show the, the split ends. Like I was using the Amica and I remember when I was using the Mika the Mini Brush Straightener, it doesn't fix my split end, that I have to even go with the flat iron again with the ends of my hair. But with this one, it actually fixed it. I'm not sure if it's because of this product. So I'm gonna go ahead and try that without this product and that I would know if it has got something to do with this one or if the brush itself fix the split ends or it doesn't it doesn't really fix the split ends but it hides the split ends so yeah so that's good again i would give this product a 9 out of 10 just because i feel like it, it was a bit too oily for me but at the same time it does help with my frizziness maybe it's just me maybe it's just that i'm not used to having my hair too shiny or oily it's not that too oily but it's just that I think maybe for me I'm not used to that kind of hair um, I don't like my hair feeling that way but I know some people needs that to help their tame their frizz and split in so yeah I, this, I give this a 9 out of 10 um, a 10 out of 10 definitely a 10 out of 10 I love this one I really do and I, I think I'm gonna keep using this one like even if I'm at home, <laughs> so just because it's just very, very convenient for me. So I like this one. So this one is not on the cheaper side. It is 199 US dollar. However, if you use my code right over here, you can actually get 20% off on your purchase. So that's that. You can purchase it on their website and you can, or you can purchase this on the Amazon. And I'm going to put the link down in the description below. Go ahead and check that out. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give this video a big thumbs up. And do not forget to hit that subscribe button down below. And I'll see you on my next video. Bye! Mm.